Up until what point before the convention did you still believe that Senator Lieberman would be the vice presidential pick? Roughly up to a week before the convention, we were still talking very seriously about Senator Lieberman, but we had always believed that in order for that to work, it would have to be a total surprise. We would have to go out and sell it to conservatives who would be against it and try to convince them that this would give us our best chance for victory. How did you pivot then from, from Joe Lieberman to Sarah Palin? When we were looking at how to win the, the fall campaign, and we always believed it was an uphill struggle, we were running against a historic candidate who was a very good candidate. We need to accomplish four things coming out of that convention. Uh, we needed to excite the middle of the electorate, independents who had abandoned Republicans and had moved to Democrats. We needed to make major gains among women voters. Uh, we needed to excite the conservative uh, base of the party. And we needed to show the American people that John McCain was, in fact, a totally different guy than the incumbent administration. You could go out and say all you wanted, I'm not George Bush, or I'm going to do this differently, or I'm going to do that differently. Saying it is one thing, but showing it is another. And that was our challenge. It was a difficult puzzle to unlock. So how did Sarah Palin's name come up? I said at the time, I said, we should take a look at Governor Palin in Alaska. She was the most popular governor in the country. She had an administration that was filled with Republicans and Democrats. There are few states, if any, in the country that had corruption problems greater than Alaska's. And she had earned herself a reputation as someone who fought that, who fought that system. She was somebody who could talk on energy issues with as high a level of expertise as uh, any politician in the, in the country. And uh, we knew that it would be a political risk um, but we felt that the, uh, that the challenge was so great that you had to take that, you had to take that political risk.